10 Flight Centre Premier League action from the Whites Hill Reserve. It's the clash between Holland Park Hawks and Logan Lightning as the two teams come out onto the park. For Holland Park Hawks, since we last saw them, Manabu Ishimoto has rejoined the club after a stint at Redlands early in the year. So too has Mark Rasmussen returning from Wolves. For Logan Lightning, they really turned it on in the second half in their win against Ipswich Knights last week. Nil all the break, but five second-half goals saw the Lightning clinch all three points. Zach Keenan has the whistle for this one, assisted by Trent Sleeman and Carmelo Pulverenti. Logan Lightning in their maroon and white strip get proceedings underway here in the first half. This Holland Park win back the ball. Now through the middle here for the Lightning. Brown, Max Brown on there for Dunker. Ball lane towards the centre for Jed Brown. And Logan Lightning have come up with the opening goal here, six minutes in. High fives all around. The ball in, unable to be defended and cleared away. And Jed Brown makes Holland Park pay full toll for that defensive lapse. And the visitors have the early lead. Ball here for Medell. Oh, and they've conceded an own goal here. Have Logan through Joseph Sensomi. Holland Park back on level terms in unfortunate circumstances here for Logan Lightning. Sensoni gives away the goal. And that's an easy gift for Holland Park to get back to 1-1. One, one. Here they come again, the Hawks. That might provide a little bit of momentum for them. Shigeyuki, it was there for the home side. McCaskill. He's gone down and remains down. Getting back to his feet now. Shigeyuki. Off the ball towards the six-yard box. Chested by Medell. And Holland Park hit the lead here through Andy McCaskill. The ball played high. Medell was unmarked. He chested it down. Couldn't control it. Stumbled. Fell fortuitously there for McCaskill. Oh, and the lights have gone out here midway through the first half. The White Seal Reserve curse has hit again. The mobile phone lights are out. Hopefully we'll be able to get this match back underway. Already got a big backlog of games. We don't want to see this one rescheduled. And now the lights are back on. And after the resumption of play, McCaskill is just going to play that for Schufelt to get this match underway again. Going down was Ebbing Wacey. Holland Park out of their own penalty area now. There's still, there's actually a Holland Park player down there in the background. Ebbing Wacey. Oh, he just takes the feet there of Takuya Shikiyuki. It looks like it a lower leg injury being carried off the park by his teammates is Shigeyuki. Ishimoto for McCaskill. Back for Medell and Schufelt had to go to his right there with the foot. Looked like Medell was going to go to the right there of the keeper but then decided to go to the left. Schufelt reacted well. Evan Wacey, tightly controlled there by two defenders. Ball into the box here for Logan. And once again, this match is on level terms. And it's Jed Brown again. His second goal of the evening and second for his side. Brown rises high to it first. There's complaints from the Holland Park defenders saying, what's their hands in the back? But the goal's going to stand. Although Ken Holland Park... Take the lead again here. Five minutes before the break. Schufelt plays that one out for a corner. It's 
So going into the second half, level here at two all. Free kick played in, taking deflection, claims of handball. And it looks like the assistant referee has ruled on it. And Zach Keenan points to the spot. Let's see if we can pick it up on the replay. That right arm just a little outstretched there. And here's Dan Smith. And customary Dan Smith style. Makes no mistake with the penalty. And Holland Park have taken the advantage here once again. Max Brown, great ball here through for Ebbing Wasey, who gets one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. And perhaps just a little bit of youthful inexperience there from Ebbing Wasey. Should have finished off that opportunity. Oh, he's won it here again. Ebbing Wasey, can he do better? Second time round, indeed he can. And once again... Here we are, back on level footing. Good win there by Ebbing Wasey. And he's able to slot the ball past Duncan Short in the Holland Park goal. 20 minutes to play, 3-3. Can one of these sides just go ahead and claim the full three points into the side netting that time around for all the Hawks? Was taking a touch through there. Here's a dark one. The substitute. Getting down low was short. Did very well there to shut off a dark was progress. Holland Park now inside the box. Luke Carr, it looked like. Putting that one wide. Ebbing Wasey again. And just gets his feet tangled up there. Able to get an effective shot away in the end. Into stoppage time. A dark one. Can he help Logan claim the three points here? Greer gets around Rasmussen. Greer save from short onto the back stick. They're still going to threaten here. Ah, uh, Logan and Brown lofts that one high. Now a chance for Holland Park down the other end. That'll do it on a shared here at the Whites Hill Reserve in this Round 10 Flight Centre Premier League match. It's Holland Park Hawks 3, Logan Lightning 3.